Hi, it's Sine again, and today's unscripted video is brought to you <laughs> as a result of a, an email I received from a client. Um, she had recently published a new piece of content on her blog, and it wasn't appearing on the home page, and she emailed me to find out why. I've got her on Elegant Themes, a, a great premium theme that makes some um, publishing new content make you look really professional but it does have a little quirk that I want to address. In Elegant Themes, particularly the later and newer versions, um, he has a auto-blocking of new content that takes place uh, that Anne is running up against. So if you're ready, let's take a quick look at uh, why that's happening and how to, how to change that. Okay, so I've opened her blog, and she had left me a, a message in the IM to let me know that she published a new piece of content called uh, Pirates in Your Office. And I scroll down and I look, and of course, you know, Pirates in Your Office is not visible. So she's right. It wasn't just a question of it taking a little while to show up. So then I opened her dashboard, and I went and looked to see where that content was being published to. So Pirates in Your Office was published to customer service, a category called customer service. Then I opened the themes options, so under appearance, and then her particular theme is called pure type. I opened the theme options to find out why. Now as I mentioned, Elegant Themes has a wee bit of a quirk in that he has a really nifty options panel set up, uh, but by default what you're looking to publish comes in as blocked. So, for example, in this particular theme, on the navigation for the categories, these items that are marked red will, by default, not show up in the drop-down menu. Okay, so by drop-down menu, I mean this area right here. So if these are um, the categories, okay, they're not going to show up here if they have a red X here. So by flipping these by turning these on we're telling the theme to let that type of content whatever's in that category appear in those drop down menus okay and we we don't well I'm going to go ahead and put seminars on because I'm not really sure if she wants them or not but I'll put them on and ask later uh, the second area is general settings now general settings on the home page there is a section that says exclude categories from home page recent posts and as you can see there are four that have been um, auto blocked from appearing on the front page so all we have to do is turn these from red X's to green check marks and they will appear on the home page now if she publishes new content to customer service again it will automatically show up but if she publishes new content and creates a new category without coming into these options it will not appear so again this is a, a quirk of elegant themes now actually I say it a quirk like it's a bad thing and it's really not he provides you the ability to turn on and turn off specific pieces of content in specific areas of your blog which I find to be a very useful and valuable setting within a theme but do be advised that if you publish a new piece of content you create a new category when you create it then you are going to need to come into your blog theme options and tell the theme that it's okay to publish that content to the home page or to the category okay so now that we have saved it uh, down here at the bottom now that we've saved it we can go over and take a look uh, on the home page and if we click and do a refresh we should now see that new piece of content appearing um, as the most recent post now that it's refreshed let's take a look and sure enough that new piece of content is there so and I hope this has helped and to the rest of you who have elegant themes um, good job <laughs> it wasn't you it was a quirk uh, go change your theme options to get past that so till next time this is Sine signing off